Alright, well I came out here and found this radio sitting on my chair, so I guess I gotta do something with it. Oh yeah, that's right, I put it there. So, I'm gonna hook it up somewhere. I don't know where. I don't really like hooking anything up over here. I can't really get to it. Same thing with down here. And same thing with down here. So, either it has to go over here, or it has to go over there, if I'm going to use it. I don't want it over here because this is my work area. So, I'm trying to decide where to put it. I haven't really used this radio much. Um, it's the one that I bought, along with that tuner. That I, uh, the 9882, which it tried briefly and I found that the meter was really odd. So I opened it up and checked everything. And I found a cold solder joint on the uh, balance line output. And I fixed it, but anyway, I wasn't using the balance line, so that wasn't an issue. It just doesn't really work well. This one is a really weird, it's a really weird tuner. It has um, like a one-to-one -one balance or something in it, whether you like it or not. I'm trying to remember. Yeah, I, I can't remember. It's not a four-to-one balance and it's, it's not in the normal spot. It's a really weird tuner. Um, not, not like these ones. See how much bigger this thing is? This is a 989. Uh, what they would call, you know, legal legal limit. I think it even says that on it. 3 kilowatt. That's input, by the way. This is. So they, when they, they say this is 3 kilowatt, okay? But they call this 2.5 kilowatt. So... I'm not sure if this one's been rated honestly or input or output. Um, the components aren't a lot bigger in it, so anything's possible. Anyway, I need to figure out where I'm going to put this and then uh, just kind of sit down and play around with it.